Hey guys, Simmons Place here, and today I'm going to be showing you my build of the Undertale Judgment Hall with the Furniture Mod by XP Games LLC from the description in the video. So, here we go. Um, at the start, we have obviously the floor with the mod, which will be in the description. And I have the windows, and if you step back a sec, and show this thing is giant. This took me so long to make it. I use commands and everything just to make everything to scale, but it took me so long, especially for characters. But I got Frisk and Sans in the front. And the pillars, which took me a while as well. And if I were to give myself a light block, I'll just type in now. Slash give myself a light block. Because then you'll be able to see how I've lit everything up using commands. Because otherwise you wouldn't be able to see a single thing I've built. So a light block, 115. That basically just applies the light level to it. Use this for your build as well, it's amazing. And then I just need to hold it in my hand and look at that. That's all the light locks. If I just step back, like, see this build? That's everything I'm using to light this up. It's not even rendering tidy. It just proves how big this build is. But, um, yeah, I've got Sans and Frisk. This is where the Sans boss fight happens in the genocide route of Undertale. And if I set my time to night, you can see it all glows up because of the light. Otherwise, the shadows will be covering the entire build, but... Yeah, this is one of my favourite parts of Undertale, my, one of my favourite games aside from Minecraft, so... If you haven't got Undertale, you should definitely play it, but I've got the windows all detailed and everything. I couldn't build up full scale, otherwise it'd look all stretched and stuff, but... Yeah, this took me so long to make, but... If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. Goodbye!